Good morning, this is Sneaks and I'm going to be showing you how to make a seismic sensor. Um, I'd use my Wiremod forum name but I can't pronounce it anyway and more people call me Sneaks anyway so anyway um, let's just get a frame made here um, okay, this was a lot easier when I did it before. I'm, pro I'm probably gonna mess up here a couple of times, so um, yeah, that um, looks alright. Anyway, we're gonna need an oscilloscope, I think it's called, um, which is this. Takes a X and a Y value and makes a nice little line, which we're going to use. If you don't know what a seismic, uh, can't get this one there. Ah, damn it. Um, if you don't know what a seismic sensor is, it's um, a device used to measure earthquakes and such. Well, I guess just earthquakes, really. Um, it's usually a needle on a piece of paper which just draws a line, and then when there's like a, a shake in the ground, the needle measures it and makes a nice little. Uh, I'm moving my hand here, but you can't see that. It makes a nice little uh, spike on either side of the zero line, and that's what we're going to try to do here. Now, I'm probably going to digress a lot, because I have a tendency to start talking about random stuff, but I hope you can look at that. Anyway, um, <laughs> we're going to need, um, this is our screen, which is going to have our line, it's going to go here, um, oops, yeah, yeah you in a second. Okay, so first off, we will need a timer chip, gate, whatever. Um, I'll put that here. Then we're going to need a speedometer, um, there. Uh, now for this version, we're only going to be measuring when um, it, when the device gets shaken up and down. Okay, that probably made you seasick, sorry about that. Um, um, when the device goes up and down, so it won't be measuring uh, when it's moving side to side or back or front. So we're going to have uh, split outputs to XYZ on for the speedometer. And we'll place that here. Now. So far, so good. Now we're going to make our expression gate. This is actually surprisingly simple. Um, um, let me just go out of that. I'm going to do some talking here again. Um, sorry about that. Anyway, this is surprisingly simple. First, when um, when I made this, um, actually, let me just, it's easier to talk, well, okay, let's just call this size, mic, okay, I uh, can't remember how the hell it's spelled, anyway, we're going to need an input of uh, time, and, um, let's just call that speed, for the speedometer. And we need an output of, oops, that's the timer going off telling me that I've hit the, the, um, yeah, we're going to do the rest in part two, sorry. 